Hello. Good, Good afternoon. Okay. So I'm just uploading yesterday's video. Uh, sorry, I just thought I'd switch it up a little bit and put the hearts on. Okay, so I'm just gonna. My eyebrows are quite skinny today, but they're quite bold, which I don't like. I don't like the bold brows anymore. I really like the powdered. The, I don't know, the brows that I did in my makeup video, which I do realise that I haven't actually uploaded yet, so I hope maybe that'll be my task for today. I've got an hour until I need to be at work, so I don't know why I'm stressing. I'm not stressing. Just going fast. We've got some washing on the go that I need to put out once it's done. I hope that will be done soon. No, it won't be done soon. It just sounds like it will be done soon because it's taking so long. I need to make my lunch and have something to eat. I'm going to have some inner calm this morning as well. I need to get dressed and I think that's it. Something exciting I did this morning though. I did an online tarot course. Well, I've applied to do an online tarot course because it was free on Facebook for four weeks. So I thought, hey, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do this because I thought it was quite cool that the first letter of manifestation that I did, and sort of the second one, I did a reading. Whether it's tarot or palm reading, I don't know. But one of my intentions for the first letter was to be good at tarot reading and a tarot course has come up so I thought I'm going to take that opportunity and I'm going to learn how to read tarot because I want to do it. And luckily I already had a deck and she recommended this deck for sort of beginners and but I need to, she said get a, she said find a deck and choose a deck that you want to choose, well learn from and read that you sort of connect with um that's the right shape size and practicality for you and for your learning and just for reading in general i didn't choose this deck my mum did and i really like it because it is the it's not the traditional sort of deck it's traditional in the sense that it's a weight deck yeah there's three different types of decks there's a soft soft deck that came out in 1944 was designed by Frida Harris and produced by Alistair Crawley. They sort of work together and they've got a lot of, a lot of references to astrology, which I think is quite cool because I quite like astrology. But I like moon and stars and find them cute and interesting. Uh, so I might get that at some point. There's the Marseille deck, which came out in the 18th century. It's originally produced a divination. Um, the major arcana are much more detailed than the minor arcana which makes it kind of difficult to read because there's um 52 cards in the minor arcana deck there's 22 major 56 arcana you can't just read from the major arcana i mean you can do reading readings from the major arcana i don't i don't really know how to describe it then there's the weight deck that i've got well it's very popular every single card is illustrated it sort of avoids astrology so you can get like a more sort of re not realistic but sort of realistic interpretation of the cards i'm so bad at explaining things but i've only just learned about it so i will be bad at it but in short i might try and choose my own deck i have found that they are kind of expensive though but i do want to stick for the traditional sort of design oh that's cold currently sat here with no trousers on <laughs> Oh, it feels nice to wear clean clothes and to be clean. Maybe I should do gratitudes every day. I am grateful to be able to wear clean clothes and to be clean. Right, I am going to get dressed. Good evening. How is everybody? I feel like I'm on the news. I'm not on the news, obviously. I'm just on my laptop. But anyway, so haven't uploaded in like probably five days by the time I actually upload this. Um, I've had a lot of issues with this. This, why is me and Emily, is crap. Hate it. So what have I just gone and done this evening? I've gone and bought myself a new phone. Um, I'm getting the, 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 the Huawei Smart 2021 and I'm very, very excited. I've just spent like the last hour, not hour, like 
half an hour, 45 minutes or so, um, comparing phones with Rose on Skype. And I've gone and done it. I've gone and bought myself a new phone. My contract runs out in either February, March or April. But I can't check because the EE site is being worked on or something. And EE is just... I don't know what's going on with EE, but my Wi-Fi is not working properly, nor is my data, because I'm with EE for both. So I can't even check when my contract runs out, which is fab. I mean, I could probably go into my phone settings and see when I got the phone, but, you know. So, yes, exciting times are to be had. Uh, it's, I've, I mean, I've literally just ordered it. It's the 10th of January, and it says within the next three to five working days or five to seven working days, so I have no idea when it's going to arrive. I mean, it does say the 12th of January, which is Tuesday, which is very, very exciting, and I'm hoping that the rest of my Romwe order will come as well. Funny thing about my Romwe, I ordered something... Uh, I can't remember when. I ordered a load, and I mean like a load of stuff, including a lot of work stuff that I really want now, one day. And then I think either the day after, no, it was later on that day, I ordered a jacket and some fake tattoos, which arrived yesterday. But the original, well, the first order that I made hasn't arrived yet. It does say the 12th to the 21st of January, so I'm hoping that it will arrive Tuesday along with my new phone. Fingers crossed. So I've got these ones, and these are glow-in-the-dark cat tattoos. Yes! Very excited. And then I've got these. Kind of got this one because I wanted to see... I, I got all of these because I wanted to test out some tattoos that I want to get. So I do want, like, leaves going round my arm like that. You couldn't even see that. Leaves going round my arm like that. And there's some more on this one. These have just got roses on as well. I do want to get some, like, these nice roses on my arm somewhere. But I want a snake down this arm. I don't really know what to do. But yes, this one's also got some fish, which I really like. Because it's almost like a sort of Pisces thing. And I like the flower behind. I really like red tattoos. This jacket has the... Two days and two buttons already fallen off it, but this is lovely. And another downside is it doesn't have pockets. It looks better when I don't have this jumper on, but what else has happened? Because I did film some things and then some days I didn't film anything just because I was like, not really any point because I've been doing anything. So we're, um, it's all over the news now, so I can talk about it, but we're doing COVID vaccinations at work now, so it's going to be very stressed from Thursday. But hopefully I have a new phone to play with while I get the stress. So I may be record keeper for that, which is where I have to watch them do the injection and just write down everything. And it's very confidential what I have to write down. Well, I mean, there's all details and things, but it's all very confidential and I can't break anything like that. But I don't know whether I'm doing that role or not. There hasn't really been anything that interesting. Oh, that's me singing. This was singing while I was drunk. Oh, God. new to the rest of that so yeah, that that was actually not that bad to listen to usually i'm like oh no i don't i don't really know what else has happened to be honest um we've had i mean over the last couple of days we've had um people from cranley which was my old store coming and covering so it was really it's been really really nice to see them again i was on i've been on skype quite a lot obviously because that's all I ever do with my evenings now it's probably why I haven't been filming but just nothing interesting has happened Rose taught me how to play ukulele well she taught me how to play C which now sounds awful which now sounds awful because this is Finn's old ukulele and whenever anyone like touches it it like goes out of tune awful. 
there you go. There's all sorts of dust and yuck on that, and I don't really want to touch a teddy ball, so I might have to clean it or give it back to him. Okay, shall we do a tattoo? Let's do a tattoo. So that's that guy. Okay. I don't know how long you're supposed to have it on here. I haven't done like a transfer tattoo in years. Can't even really see it now. It's it's not bad. Nice. Right, should I put another one on? I can't believe that I've just bought myself a new phone. And the phone on the Huawei, because it's a Huawei, on the Huawei website is 200 quid, but on Curry's it's 180. Oh, that's cool. I will hopefully see you at some point. I'll try and get this uh, video uploaded and edited tonight. Buenos dias, see you anon. Hello. Um, it is the 11th of January. Uh, come back from work, it was a very weird day. I was just basically watching my bosses have a meltdown the whole day because it was quite funny. I had about five people in the space of 10 minutes call the store phone asking about COVID vaccines and they were like, we don't fucking know, go away. And this was like throughout the day. We were doing so much stuff as well, I've done quite a lot today. But it was a good day, it wasn't bad. Apart from this morning, I was um, really anxious and I couldn't stop thinking about Finn. And this wasn't the best, not really what I needed. I um, decided that I'm gonna just try and start manifesting now that I've read all of part one of make it happen i'm gonna give it a go i'm gonna give it a go and i started doing one of the first well the first exercise that's in the book where you write down all your feelings through all your thoughts throughout the day and this was the space of five minutes but i didn't realize that i don't really think that much i don't think as much as i thought i did like i just mainly have music in my head all the time so that was quite eye-opening and quite nice, to be honest. Um, the majority of what I was thinking about was him, which is great. So I'm going to try and do it again tomorrow. See what we'll compare, in a way. See if I have a better day tomorrow than I did today in terms of thoughts and feelings. But I've returned home to the rest of my runway order, so I'm going to do... And um, an opening. I actually kind of forgotten what I bought. I'll do some trying on because I can. Ooh. Don't worry, I'm not gonna completely strip. So this is top, and it feels really nice actually. Oh wow! Look how cute. That's really sweet. Let's try that on. Yeah, this is really cute. I like this. I feel like this is wonky though. But ne nevertheless, I think this is really sweet. Oh, forgot that I got these. So I don't wear jeans like at all anymore. I got these. And the flares. Oh, that's exciting. They look massive. I don't think my thighs are that fucking big. I don't know if I'm standing away because I'm going to edit the fact that I'm getting done dressed in front of the camera out. Oh, my thighs do fit in this. <laughs> These are a perfect fit. What the hell? Now, the big question, do they make my bum look good? You can't see. I mean, I think they need to be washed so I can. they feel a bit better, but... I like them. It's also very, very dark in here. Hang on. Will that work? That light is brighter than my future. <laughs> right, what else have we got? I think these are another pair of trousers. Ah, these are my joggers. I got some joggers. Well, these are very thin. Oh my god, they match my top! That's amazing! Awesome. The cuffs are a bit big, like they're not very cuffed, really. 
but I like these. These would be quite nice for summer, I think. Just purely because they're so thin. I forgot that I bought a phone case and I've literally just bought a new phone. But that's my phone case. It's really cute. I'll just put it on my phone now. I'm not going to put it on my phone now because it's miles too big. So, try and sell that on Depop probably. <laughs> oh, I'm not going to put these on now, but these are fishnets that have got snakes on them. Oh, I've got a little crystal charm for my keys. I don't know what this is. I'm hoping these are my work trousers. I think these are, these are my work trousers. Oh my god, they're literally like leggings. I thought they were going to be different. Oops. They're huge, but these are kind of exactly what I wanted. Okay. So these are like massive flares. Actually, not really exactly what I wanted, but it's okay. They're nice to wear around the house. I don't think I'll wear them at work, but... Well, we'll see. They've got a little slit up the side as well, which will make them quite sweet. This is another top. <gasps> really excited about this one, okay. Oh god, oh god. Oh god. I'm so excited about this one, okay. So this is the front. Before I spawn, and this is the back. <laughs> I might have to wear it back to front. This is a men's t shirt. It's not as big as I'd want, but it's okay. Bam! Look at that! Samurai cat. And then lastly, we've got another shirt, which is a bit different. Which is a different colour to what I thought it would be. So this is last shirt. Ta da! Pardon me. So it's not as long, but I think this one was supposed to be a crop top. But I like it. I like it, it's cute. God, I'm bloated. Look at that, I look pregnant. Jesus. But there you go. That's the second part to my one we haul. That's exciting. I'm I'm happy with most of it. I mean the case is annoying, but I think it's probably a good thing that it doesn't fit, seeing as I've got a new phone. It's a really cool case, though. Look at it. I've got the next couple of days off. And then, after that, I start working as a record keeper for the vaccines, which is cool, I think. <laughs> Very tired. I really want alcohol. But I know that that's not a good idea tonight. Oh, well. I mean, mum wouldn't hurt, but I, I, I don't know whether I can risk it. I need to go food shopping at some point. But I'm hoping to do that tomorrow. I think I'll leave it there for now. I'll either see you tomorrow or tonight. I don't know when. Goodbye. I feel... I want to say first, I feel like I'm really not into the whole YouTube thing at the moment. But it's for my self-improvement and I'm not doing it for anyone. I'm doing it for myself. So, in a sense, I would be letting myself down if I don't carry on. But... I've got to take breaks with it and, you know, mm, I don't know. But anyway, I will see you at some point.